For the past decade, New Mexico has had some of the highest opioid-related death rates in the country. Now, to combat this, two years ago, lawmakers passed legislation that required police officers to carry Narcan, a drug designed to reverse an opioid overdose. Well, a Target 7 search for solutions discovered the drug is rarely being used by some agencies. A kit like this being carried by hundreds of cops throughout the state is supposed to save the life of someone who's having an opioid overdose. It's state law that every cop carries one. Former state rep Sarah Maestas Barnes authored the legislation after two of her high school classmates died from an opioid overdose. People that you would never imagine would be impacted by this epidemic have been impacted. Her classmates are two of thousands of New Mexicans who have died in the past 10 years from opioids. During that time, New Mexico has some of the highest opioid-related death rates in the country. So are these kits working? In two years, state police have used it six times. Albuquerque Police, the state's largest agency, has used it three times, according to its medical director. City Councilor Diane Gibson wants to save more lives. She had authored a city ordinance requiring APD to carry Narcan. I would have thought that we would have had the opportunity to use that more. This is a kit typically used by law enforcement. On the instructions, it says it has to be stored between 59 and 77 degrees. Well, this is a vehicle driven by a lot of APD cops. And as you can see, it's a lot warmer than 77 degrees. And this particular kit that was being stored in a police car expired two months ago. These kits cost anywhere between $125 and $150. APD bought 80 of them two years ago and put them only in the patrol sergeant's vehicles. Now the majority of them are expired. How do we put a price on human life? Pharmacists at the University of New Mexico tell Target 7 that even though the drug is expired and might not be stored properly, it might still work. UNM psychologist Brandy Fink has been researching the opioid epidemic for the past several years and has been working to get Narcan more available to people who are using opioids. Of course, we have to deal with issues of, you know, the kits expiring and, and temperature and things like that, but they were available um, to save those three lives. Fink says the law makes more sense for rural communities than in large cities where ambulances might show up before a police officer. She believes more lives will be saved as more officers get Narcan in their squad cars. APD tells Target 7 they have received state funding to purchase more kits and hope to have them in every patrol car by June of next year. Now, in the past three and a half years, the Bernalillo County Sheriff's Office has used Narcan 25 times and saved 17 people.